Fans of the Kanati ship have every right to have anticipated a happy ending for the Big Brother Titans power couple. Unlike several ships in the first season of BB Titans, Kanaga Jr. and Tati remain solid, committed and devoted to each other literally the entire time. And one of the most noteworthy things about their relationship for me is that it always felt genuine, authentic and real. Every time you tune into the live broadcast of the popular show, which stays on air 24-7 for about 3 months by the way, You'd see these two lovebirds melting hearts with their displays of affection. When I say it was all the time, Kanati was just that couple that anchored the foundation of love in the house, man, and kept giving everyone something to aspire to amongst the housemates, the viewers, and the shippers. And what's more, they dealt with challenges in the most mature way. This one time, the royals, a pair that consisted of Tati and Ibubu, used their veto power safe privilege to rescue Blake Lang instead of Kaniva. Now, in some cases, that would have been a deal breaker because what the hell could be the reason you are not saving your boyfriend, girl? Nothing. And yes, I think most sensible people understand that the royals had to save Blake Lang and return the favor. It was a decision based on integrity, loyalty, and human decency. Still, I think we can all understand a perspective that views Tati's moves and decisions as a failure to protect her poor thing. In this theory, some people just felt like Tati should have betrayed the alliance with Black Lang in order to protect her household. Now, imagine how controversial it would have been had Kanaga Jr. been evicted after that very move. See? And instead of questioning Tati's loyalty and even doubting how she feels about him, Kanaga Jr. understood that this had to happen. And not only that, that it was a reflection of good character. That's what sensible people do. And this is just one example of how Kanati resolved conflict in the house. And I'm not even comparing. Nah, but work with me. These lovers were able to sustain a very mellow relationship and work through challenges without breaking a sweat. While on the other side of the house, Koyemi and that love triangle were constantly in shambles. <laughs> I've definitely always been a Koyemi shaper, by the way, but yeah, the drama. Even if you get mad, even if you yes, get offended, ma so what you gonna do? Because I guarantee you, you can't beat me up. So side by side, Kanati definitely seemed way more stable and way more secure. But since their departure from the house, it's been crickets. Hey, Kanati, what's popping? Can you wear child supposed to be soulmate in the house? Kana, Kana, Nick's Kanati. There's no Kanati. It seems. So, exactly what really happened? Stick around as we look back at the rise and fall of Big Brother Titans power couple Kanaga Gina and Zati Wendy Madiba. They clearly could have been a big deal, but the love that once melted Africa seems to have been iced up. Share your take in the comments, smash the like button, and subscribe to the channel. We know by now that housemates typically go in the house with some sort of a strategy. A lot of them will deny it in the end, but facts. And for good reasons. When you go in the house with a complete strategy for how you intend to play the game and navigate life in the house, it might be harder for you to adapt and be flexible. Which sucks because you don't even know if people in the house are even vibing with that strategy of yours. That said, I'm willing to bet whatever coin is in my account, if there's anything left at all in there, that sometimes housemates can feel pressure to get involved with someone in the house just so they can appease shippers outside and gain a fan base. It seems to say that Kanati did not fall in that category. By all indications, their relationship was as real as it gets. And while some people may have felt that one partner might have just been into the relationship more than the other, I think we can pack up that whole narrative. Kanaga Jr. and Sati clearly cared deeply for each other. But we are here to call a thing a thing, so we will remember some issues that the fan bases dragged on and on. I mean, again, things were not always perfect between Kanati. There was a time where they were going through some trouble in the house, so we are here to keep it real. But first, let's go back way back when. Kala Kanaga Emmanuel Demi popularly known as Kanaga Jr. is an aspiring actor and model. And on a certain Sunday earlier this year, the 24-year-old ABR state native first laid eyes on a certain Mutati Wendy Madiba. 
The bubbly beauty and brains was still very laid back at this point and both of them soon started hanging out and getting to know each other. The bubbly beauty and brains were still very laid back at this point and both of them would soon start hanging out and getting to know each other. It didn't take long before they couldn't keep their hands off each other and were often seen spending a lot of time in each other's company. Within a matter of days, fans had already dubbed their ship as Kanati, which combines their names Kanaga Jr. and Zati. And by then, both of them were getting quite vulnerable with each other and even crying in each other's arms when opening about their journeys back in Nigeria and South Africa. It really was the sweetest thing. And it didn't take long before it started becoming evident that these two were some of the front runners as individuals and as a couple in the house. They became really, really popular with fans. I think Kanaga Jr's popularity gained momentum first, but it wasn't long before we found out that Zati's own fan base was not playing with none of y'all. And together, a force. I mean, we are talking about the top three here, so... There's a lot of speculation going around about why Kanaga Jr and Zati have decided to go their separate ways. And to do that quite abruptly, leaving fans with more questions than answers. In recent interviews, they've both shot down any narrative of animosity between them. And have instead insisted that it's just they are not seeing anyone at that moment. No bad blood there. I get it, some people were saying, maybe after coming out of the house, Kanaga Jr. might have been upset that Zati was once flaky when asked how serious she is about Kanaga Jr. According to this theory, he might have felt that she had been using him the entire time and Vele Vele had no intention of holding down a serious relationship. But while that outlook is not entirely far-fetched, I do think that two people who cared so deeply about each other would have found a way to unpack every single strange thing that took place in the house and then decide if it's worth fussing over or whether they are good to go outside in the real world. At the end of the day, Big Brother is a social experiment that removes people from their normal lives and puts them in a place where they are under the supervision of cameras and the constant exposure to millions of people across the continent. Weird moments are bound to happen, especially when there is also money to be won and a game to be played. Now, I don't think there's any animosity between them. In an interview with the Guardian newspaper in Ghana, Karaga did say that Zati truly remains one of his highlights in the house. And similarly, Zati has maintained that the two of them are cordial and cool with each other. To be honest, it's quite an adjustment to see them being cordial and cool with each other. Because sometimes they feel just a tiny bit removed from being strangers at this point. And how does that happen? Because literally just months ago, Karaga Jr. and Zati could not go that long without being in the arms of each other. Despite having spent months in the same city, they have barely hung out and, you know, obviously jump on a live or do some stories together or something like that. Just, you know, something to wrap up the chapter of their lives and give their shippers closure. What do you guys think of Kanati? Do you think there's a future there or do you think they should proceed individually? Talk back in the comments, smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. Until next time, peace.